Jamaica celebrated its 61st independence this past week and Jamaicans in Zimbabwe joined in the fun. No, man. Yeah. Straight out of yard, man. It's straight out of yard. Yeah. We're here now and we're loving it. Big up. Big up. <laughs> Big up. Love, love, so nice. Can you tell me why? This was my first time meeting the full Jamaican community in Zimbabwe. Come with me as we celebrate our 61st independence. Jamaica, my island home, is known for its immaculate beaches, tropical weather, flavorful food, world-class athletes, impactful music, and culture. We little but we talawa. Greetings from the island, nation <laughs> of Jamaica. Blessing. Who hmm? shall bless no man kiss? How are you enjoying Jamaica? No, it's fine so far. Well, Mrs. Say 15. You look like you come from here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Tony has been to Jamaica. He's interacted with the local people. He's met my friends, my family. He's driven around, gotten used to the towns. Uh, he even explored the food, went to the beaches. The Jamaican dance. <laughs> but in the end, he flew back to Zimbabwe and brought me along with him. As a Jamaican living in Zimbabwe, it's like Christmas discovering that there's a growing Jamaican community and what better occasion to meet up than for independence celebration. So I'm here at Sora Restaurant. We're having a Jamaica Independence Day celebration and it's awesome. There are a lot of Jamaicans here and it was great discovering that there are more of us here in Zimbabwe just meeting up, talking, finally having a chance to just talk in a patois and if you're talking in English to be understood and it's just awesome to let loose and be free and meet others living here. So we're gonna talk with some of them so that you can also get to hear from other people, other Jamaicans, what it's like being in Zimbabwe. Now the first thing that caught my eye when I arrived at the venue was this group of Rastafarians who are not from Jamaica, they are actually Zimbabweans. Are you Rastafarian? Yeah, I'm Rastafarian. I'm from Rastafari community near Bingi, Zimbabwe, Church Kaugodia. Yes, I greet my sister in the divine name of His Imperial Majesty. As His Imperial Majesty say that we are one, Jamaica and Africa, one blood. So today, happy independent Jamaica. Oh, thank, you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. So you know to beat the yeah, we beat Can the <laughs> drum. Yeah, we beat the drum. Oh, nice. On the world stage, Jamaica has become synonymous with Rastafarianism and Bob Marley. So although most Jamaicans are actually not Rastas, it's not surprising to see Bob Marley and the Rastafarian legacy on display whenever Jamaica is placed in the spotlight. Now, since Bob Marley, Rastafari, and Reggae are synonymous with Jamaica, how can we celebrate our Independence Day to the rhythm of any other music but Reggae? Unbelievably, we had a local artist called Shilo with his band who made us feel right at home. Rastafari, yeah. live it and rain, you know? Yeah, it's a so full joy, Jamaican Independence Day. I'm there with the Empress straight out of Portland. Portland, Jamaica. Jamaica. Yeah. yeah, man, you see me there. Yeah, mm -hmm. love it, Rastafari. So you're telling me that, you know, you believe in not, because, not having nationality. Well, I don't believe in anything, you know. From someone believes, them not know. So I know that I and I is an African. So we now have no nationality, we now have no border. He's a melanated son of the soil, son of the most time. Perfect balance. Yeah, I was asking you if you're a You told me it's complicated. Yeah, man, in a way. Well, I'm just a Zimbabwean, Ethiopian, Kemetic, Hebrew, Israelite, Nazarite, Rastafari. That is one thing for I and I. It's Babylon, them divide. You know what I mean? But it's one away. 
like Jamaica say, out of many, one people. One people. Rastafari. Have you been to Jamaica? Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, where were you going? Yeah, yeah Mandeville, there yeah, Kingston. And we're there with North yes, Jamaican yes, artists. Yes. Yes. Sister, my brethren, Tony Rep. We got Sister. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah man. Yeah, Sister Fabi, Mickey General, Luciano, okay. North Reggie, okay. Loot and Fire, yeah. Etana. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah, still. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Love me, Love me. Big up. Big up. <laughs> <laughs> it's an answer reading. You ask question and then get answer. Yeah. Answer reading. <laughs> Jamaicans, please let's make Sheila honorary Jamaican. The man talk, patwa, play reggae music, can bust the dance them. Yo. Love it. Step up. <laughs> Emancipate ourselves from mental slavery. None but ourselves can free our minds. We have a saying in Jamaica that goes, we're little but we're talawa. Yeah. That means that <laughs> we're just a small little child compared with other things, but we're very Powerful. Little but we tell our him said that mean we're small but we're powerful. And you know what else is powerful, guys? Jamaican food. We had rice and peas, authentic rice and peas, authentic curried goat, authentic jerk chicken, authentic escovish fish. It was like being flown back home and eating from you know my pot in my mommy's kitchen. But anyway, guys, it was good. We had food from home and it was mwah. For you guys who've been asking, I'm finally having to make it. No guys, I haven't forgotten to mention where this was. This was at the Sorrel restaurant, one of the two new Jamaican restaurants in Zimbabwe. Yes, these are authentic Jamaican restaurants owned and ran by Jamaicans. So take it from me guys, these restaurants are authentic Jamaican restaurants, okay? Don't doubt it, uh, we've had people coming up to, to me and asking, oh, is it really Jamaican? Is the food really Jamaican? Are these guys really Jamaican? Yes, we really have Jamaicans in Zimbabwe. Zimbabweans, please believe it, yes, we're black, so we look just like you guys, but we have a Jamaican community and these are authentic Jamaican restaurants, so check them out. Now my favorite part, sorrel, not the restaurant, sorrel the drink. This is sorrel juice or sorrel drinks. We have this back home during the festive season and I can't believe I'm getting a chance to have it while here in Zimbabwe. It means so much. Huh? You from sorrel, where? Here in, here in, here in Zimbabwe. I couldn't believe I spent all this time not tasting sorrel when there are people in Zimbabwe actually farming sorrel. Wow. Okay, okay, okay. We've delayed you guys for too long. Now it's time to meet some Jamaicans. Out of yard, man. It's straight out of yard. Yes, Everything yes, so you're good, following now. Every time, man. Every time. From before I come here. Oh, really? really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. From before. Oh, you come across the channel. Because, uh, as I said, the moment Rob said, Zim, we start check out everything. Mm -hmm. So we will check out because uh, that, that's when I start following uh, the guy from Ghana. Yeah, the what am I? Uh, yes. Pick up Maya. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my so then I saw, wait. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm not so weird. <laughs> but there's a next youth down here, too. Mm -hmm. Uh, I saw him on a different channel, but he mm. doesn't have a YouTube channel. He doesn't have a YouTube? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, man. So, I bless you. I love every time. Oh, yeah, thanks mama. for subscribing. Come out of Portland. Man. She come from Tino. Yeah, Portland. Where you right. come from? Me? Well, originally, I'm a Westman, but I live in Ochi. Ochi. Yes. I you know you're the Zimbabwe. I'm nominated as Zim. Tell the people them how you feel. You <laughs> ah, reach Africa man, first time Zim on the continent. Zim is beautiful, man. Zim nice. Africa nice. Uh, I went to South Africa, Johannesburg. Love it. Mm -hmm. It's like anywhere in America. It's like yeah. Miami. It's like New York. Yeah, 
Come on, also Africa the nice sale. man. Africa well nice man. Mm. Yeah man, big up yourself again. Yeah, yeah man. man, thanks. Ah, One love. love. Yeah man, cool, cool. <laughs> See, My name is Nev. I'm a Jamaican living in Zim. I'm loving it here. Absolutely fantastic. It's the best thing I ever did was to come to the motherland, set at home in Zimbabwe and we're just loving it. Fantastic. Yeah. Yes, um, Jamaican, Enjoy. my wife is Zimbabwean. Mm -hmm. um, we have a choice uh, leaving the UK either to go to Jamaica or, or to Zimbabwe. How we, long were you in Zimba uh, the UK in, for? I was in UK for over 20 years. Uh, but when we went to Zimbabwe a couple of uh, times, and I love it here. And then, then we went to Jamaica a couple of times, and my wife loved it there. <laughs> <laughs> so we, it was a toss to say, where do we go? Yeah. We wanted to leave the UK, um, and we end up in Zimbabwe. So yeah. Zimbabwe won. Yeah, yes, yeah. Yeah, now, and we're loving it. Lovely, Fantastic. lovely. Yeah. Thank you so much. No worries. <laughs> such an honor to be here and doing uh, celebrating Jamaica with the fellow Jamaicans in Zimbabwe. I hope you are doing well, <laughs> tapping into some of your good luck. Yeah. All <laughs> yeah. the best. Thank you. Hi Woody, I love you so much. You inspired me to come home. You really did. I love you so much. Hi, Miss Trudy. Come on, we're waiting for the children. I used to bother you and say you've got to marry her. Now you've married her. Yeah. We want little woodies. We want little woodies. Shout out, Mother Maya. We met Mwah. your Mwah. Love you. subscriber here. She's, she loves you so much. I really do. Yeah, I you're doing a good job. And my son loves you. <laughs> had such a blast celebrating our Independence Day, we took it right into Independence Night. Sheila was back again, this time with an acoustic set, which is my favorite type of music. You know, I play the acoustic guitar. Uh, I used to back up sing, you know, back home. And this was my type of thing, jamming with my, you know, Rasta friends and stuff. This really brought me back home and I enjoyed it. This was the most fun I had in a while. It was a lovely day, an extraordinary night, and most of all, it was just refreshing meeting other Jamaicans here in Zimbabwe. Thanks for watching yet another episode. Mega family, we love you, we appreciate you, thank you for your support, and we hope you continue to watch, share, like, and subscribe. Love, love, so nice. Don't tell me why. I'm sad.